Let's convert the decimal 0 0.68 to a fraction. And here's how we'll do it. We're going to call this 0 0.68 over 1. It's still equal to 0 0.68, but now we have the start of a fraction. What we need to do is get 0 0.68 to a whole number. And we can do that. We have one, two decimal places. So two decimal places, we can do that by multiplying by 100. So 100 times 0 0.68 that equals 68. So now we have a whole number. But we can't just multiply the numerator by 100. We also have to multiply the denominator by 100. That's because 100 divided by 100 is just 1. So we're multiplying by 1. We don't change the value, just the representation. So 100 times 1, that would be 100. So the decimal 0 0.68 is equal to 68 over 100 as a fraction. But we can reduce this fraction and simplify it a little bit further. So let's give ourselves some room. And if we divide the numerator by 2 and the denominator by 2, since they're both even numbers, 68 divided by 2 is 34, and 100 divided by 2 is 50. And we can even simplify this further. We have even numbers here. 34 divided by 2 is 17, and 50 divided by 2 is 25. So the decimal 0 0.68 can also be represented by a fraction, 17 over 25. They are equal. If you divide 17 by 25, or 34 by 50, or 68 by 100, you get 0 0.68. This is Dr. B, and thanks for watching.